Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I have a clip from my live stream, or a pretty long clip, that is basically just me doing my first clear of Simulated Universe World 6 uh, in Honkai Star Rail. And if you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel as well if you're new guys. We'll be jumping straight into things in a moment. Uh, but essentially I'll have a guide out very, very soon that is a very, very good, uh, easy way to just clear Simulated Universe if you're having a bit of trouble, so check that out very soon. I'll leave a card like up the top that side whatever doesn't you get the point it'll be up there soon in the future probably not when i first upload the video but i'll have a guide out pretty soon also guys consider joining my discord if you want to join a fun little mobile gaming community we essentially just talk about mobile games we share our summons we share new games we talk about new stuff we, we just have a lot of fun in general over on the server so if you want to join a small and growing community feel free to do so down there link will be down in the description below anyways guys let's jump straight into the video let us jump in i don't know Oh, wait, shit, I was already doing a run. Oh, wait, when did I do this? I didn't mean to do that. Uh, I have not watched Jin Yun's PV, uh, PV yet. We'll do that later. Um, Is this the team I would run for? Yeah, probably. Let's keep going. All right, this is midway through a run. But if we fail this run, we'll do another one. I find these enemies to be kind of annoying to deal with sometimes. They're just kind of stupid. <laughs> All right, there we go. Easy done. Oh, wait, the second wave? Shit. Uh, I was not ready for that. It should have been, though, because there was two enemies before I went into the fight. This is this is why the Bronya uh, Zela combo is just kind of busted. <laughs> because you can just do that. <laughs> like, the enemy didn't get to hit me at all just then. All right. Um, so, I know we could technically be choosing this. I'm going to be choosing only Abundance buffs because I'm trying to test something out. Uh, I'm just going to take only Abundance for this run. All right, let's see. After using the Path of Resonance, remove debuffs from all characters and apply subduing evils. Okay. Uh, after using Path of Resonance, the first two time battle Path of Resonance buffs will appear on the action order. Okay, this one is really, really good. This is an amazing skill for the, uh, the Abundance Tree thing. If you haven't used the Abundance Tree, you'll see why. This one is kind of, that one is kind of dummy broken. Actually double dummy broken. Middle and right are by far the best, but that, that middle one in particular is dummy broken. Like, it's actually- Oh, wait, what? Wait, how did I get ambushed? Wait, what the fuck? I literally- Oh, maybe the skill animation was too- Oh, fuck. Okay. I'm just gonna immediately pop it so we can get that in the queue. Uh, that thing is amazing because it's not just a one-off thing. Because you get it throughout the entirety of the queue and you also get the ability itself as well. It's so good. You just get constant heals plus your actual healer that you have as well. It's just a really, really good ability. And in my opinion, out of all of the Path of Resonances that I've used so far, it is probably the most broken one. It's very, very strong. Oh, that was, no, that wasn't the right one. That was the middle one. I chose the middle one. They're, they're in different orders every time. Yeah, it, 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 it gets swapped around. So it's, uh, where are we? Let me view this again. And uh, Path of Resonance for the ones will be, yeah, here. After Path of Resonance, energy is consumed for the first time in battle. For the Path of Resonance, the Path of Resonance for Abundance will appear in the action order. The outgoing healing provider. Yep, okay, anyways. It's, it's pretty broken. <laughs> very, very, very good. All right. So we got two abundances here. HP Resort Defense here. I think this one's probably the better one for now. If this pops up later, we'll grab that. But having the higher HP for the more abundance things I'm going with will be really, really good considering I am basically only going abundance for this run. All right, Um. so we're gonna wanna buff up this fight. This is elite. Yeah, yeah, the, uh, the you can just obliterate the Kafka mode, uh, the Kafka one, it's just super easy. All right, so we wanna start with two. All right, we wanna buff, support. Buff it to attack and crit damage again. And then we use E again. And then we ult. And boom, that's how you do a lot of damage with Zeal. I actually could have done it even better if I had more enemies. 27k. Very, very, very nice. That is some big damage. <laughs> and look, like almost in one turn, we almost killed him already. That is insane. I, I love that shit, man. Alright, uh, I'm going to put down that on the book. Get the cleanse there. Uh, unfortunately, I do not have enough skill points, which sucks, but that's fine. I to build some skill points. Ooh, okay, that's not great. Uh, we're gonna cleanse there. That is, that is true. Um, that, that's the one thing that's good about Natasha. Uh, but the thing is though, I have a cleanse also on my Bronya. So my Bronya can also perform a cleanse. So, uh, the reason why I want, uh, Bailu though is just for the big, massive, just massive heals. That's basically why. All right. Actually, I think this middle one could be really, really good for the abundance. 
Because if the damage is split up, we can outheal small amounts of damage way better than we can large amounts of damage on a single character. And plus, we also have better defenses, better HP, massive big dick heals. Honestly, I'm kind of thinking this one. This actually might be really, really good for this, for this abundance build. Because it just means that, like, it's going to be a lot harder for them to kill us. I'm kind of feeling this. And if we can get the Curious where we don't take damage for the first three turns, unless it's dots as well. This could be really risky, but it also could be really, really good for us. True. Actually, that's a good point. All right. So, uh, we might grab Tin Yun here as a backup, and the next character we'll pick up might be like a Welt or something. Uh, we're gonna chuck this, uh, chuck on that ability, just so it's in the Q order in case we need it. Just so it's repeatedly in there. I doubt we're gonna need it in this fight, but- oh, oops, wrong target, my bad. Uh, we shouldn't need it, but it's always good to have just in case we do get into an oh shit situation. Uh, gimme, give gimme give some ambition, please. Abundance, sorry, no ambition. Uh, and that's the other abundance buff we are looking at before. Uh, expose his bankruptcy. If you complete the challenge, obtain one blessing of remembrance. Oh, I hate these. Okay, they're not for buffs that I want. Um, now nah, I'm gonna play this safe and I'm just gonna do one of these. We'll do a bar destruction buff. Play this safe. I don't want to fight two of them at once. Oh, great. It could have been good, but it could have also been very risky. Alright, let's, uh, just deal as much damage as we can to this guy at this, this point in time. Uh, I'm gonna get this, I'm, I know it's weird to use this now, but I want to get the abundance thing into the queue as early as possible in these fights. Just so we get the heals kind of going in. Um, because we have a bit of time before we start actually taking a lot of damage, so... I think it's smart to do things that way. Uh, I should not have done that. Uh, I'm gonna build some skill points up while this guy is out. Cold. There we go, that's why we wanted that into the skill queue. Yeah, that, that split up damage right now is probably going to be really, really good for us because we have the abundance uh, skill tree. And a little less than I was kind of hoping for, but that's fine. Alright. Okay, 14k is very respectable. Yeah, we're going to be very, very difficult to kill. Uh, I suppose the boss fight, though, is where it's actually going to be tricky. Because the boss is probably going to likely out-damage our healing. We just need to make sure that we're, like, fully prepared for it. That's, uh... Actually, can we use food buffs during inside of this? I don't think we can, can we? Oh, well... All right, let's buff there. Uh, we got this, so we'll do the hook for Okay, cool. Get him there. All right, very nice. Let's try and get... Oh, wow, that did a whole lot of nothing. Uh, that's not good. <laughs> that didn't do a lot of damage. Why did that not do a lot of damage? Oh, my God. This is going to be a very, very bad fight for me in a minute. <laughs> How much health does this thing fucking have? Jesus Christ. Oh, you're right, you're right. Yeah, sorry, you're right. Start the path. Yeah, good point, good point. Sorry, I forgot about that for a second. God, this guy has a lot of HP. That's kind of concerning. Oh, crap. Bonio's frozen. Okay, that's not good. Uh, I need to eliminate these guys, too. Uh, let's get rid of you. Please kill. Thank God. Alright, and let's see how much damage we can get in there. Okay, good, 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 good. There we go. Easy done. Oh, okay. See, so, this is guarantee one. I'm just going to roll. Okay, perfect. Uh, charges do drop when a character's HP is restored. <laughs> oh, that is really good. Okay, goddamn. Uh, that just means we're going to have healing for days. All right, which one is the other good one? Okay. Lethal damage to rip part the resonance of under prevents them from being knocked out down to automatic energy release the path of resonance. Oh, actually, yeah, we need that for the next fight. Actually, yeah, you're right. Thank you. Thank you for reminding me of that. Um... Because we get free, we get frozen on the day. Yeah, I can't really die anyway, so it's fine. Uh, yeah, we definitely need the cleansing, actually. That's a good room. Thank you for reminding me. Um, I'm choosing blessings after we all blessings appear. I guarantee we will be destroyed once if it has been triggered one time. So, okay, we're definitely grabbing that. That's a free... That's a, <laughs> that's a bloody free... Uh, uh, free, free, free so, so we're definitely taking that. All right. Okay. Um, Let's grab just welts. I don't think we're going to need any replacements. I think we're going to be fine all the way up to the boss, which will be fine. That is really good for Zeela. Holy crap. Uh, if a character's current HP is below 50%, they're considered to have extra stacks of... 60... Wait, what? How much attack buff is that? Oh, but we're not going to really be going to be below 30 This is the problem. 
all these ones that are like below this amount of HP, we're not going to be there for very long. So, you know what? Middle one. That sounds really good. All right. Um, all right. So here's the thing. With the current team, we don't really need heals. So do I bring in something like this or like Tin Yun for extra damage? The stats aren't great though. Although I don't think these ones are much better. Should I, should I bring in uh, Fire MC for double fire damage? Or should I bring in Tin Yun? Because I, I don't, honestly, I don't think I need... Hold on. Um, so I don't, I don't even need cleanse either, don't I? Because the healing, uh, abundance healing also does cleanse, right? I should probably just bring in Tin Yun for the extra damage. Yeah, I honestly think I'm going to do that. That's probably going to do. All right, hold on. Give me a moment. All right, let's hope this works. All right, so we want to go E buff, uh, support buff, and then we want to go burn. Please, let's hope we can do this. Okay. Um, pop that immediately. Oh, yep, that goes, that's going immediately just so that goes straight into the turn order. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So we damage buff you. Damage buff. Is that everyone? Isn't everyone? Damage buff you. <laughs> Watch this big damage. This is going to be nuts. <laughs> Oh, I can't believe I got this set up perfectly already. Okay, watch this. This is gonna be uh, very, very nutty. All right, hold on. We'll do we'll do a normal on. Actually, no, we're doing it on the boss. That was 12k. All right, let's see how big this hits for. Oh, okay. That wasn't as big as I was expecting it to be. All right, ripped. <laughs> All right. Oh wait, I thought that. Ah, oh. Okay. Um. Nope, no point there. Alright, uh, anybody else got points? Yeah, the Bronya buff got lost, sadly. I timed that kind of badly. That's fine. Alright, let's just get rid of this. And get the Resurgence. Kill there. Oh, yeah, that's right. I have to let her turn. Uh, yeah, right. Abundance comes in for the clutch. Alright, let's build up some skill points while she's kind of down like this. That lasted a long less time than I thought it was going to. Okay. Dude, what was that weak shit? Come on, man. Uh, I want to make sure I'm getting rid of these things as quickly as I can, just because they can be kind of a little bit annoying. Like that. Uh, alright. I don't have much of a choice there. And that should be gone. And that way we get the buff there. And pop that. Get there. Alright. How much of it? Okay, okay. That's fine. Um... Do I pop? How far? Uh, yep, okay, we're fine. Alright, we'll get the ultimate there. We should get the cleanse on the abundance buff. Or the abundance resonance when that comes in through the queue. So that she should be freed up. Uh, we'll pop that. Alright, now she. Oh, it already ran out, anyways. Okay, um. Pop that. You know what? No, I'm gonna build up some. I'm gonna build up some things again. I'm just going to play this like nice and slow, very totally. Uh, we'll pop that. I'm just going to play this very, very totally, just so we don't lose anything. Uh, Alright. Um, actually, no. Oh, I have to use it now, don't I? Hold on, I'm just going to do single target. Because uh, I can just pop this and this should likely kill. Oh, that's right. Oh, that's why I had trouble with this fight last time. Ah, uh, <laughs> Hmm, that's a little scary. Okay, uh, I don't have a whole lot for you. Okay. Um, her having a damage buff is not fun. I'm gonna have to use Hook to try and take out that Bronya. Okay, that's good. We got another abundance on backup. Uh, no, I'm just gonna deal damage. All right, I'm gonna pop that. Take that out. All right, cool. There we go. So now that's paused. Uh, I can get. Oh, I need to build up skill points again. Where's the abundance in the skill tree? It's all the way down here. All right, I'm gonna pop it in. Probably now. Yeah. 
All right, uh, I want the blast here. I'm gonna use the ultimate. I should have saved the ultimate for when her break came about. That was kind of stupid. God damn it. All right. Let's take the time to build up some skill charges again. I swear to God, I, I don't care if you summon the frost things, just don't summon, she's summoning a Bronya. Oh no, that's me, that's me. Okay, never mind. As long as she doesn't summon another Bronya, I'm fine with that. The Bronya is the thing in this fight that's kind of annoying. All right. Let's bring up this. That. All right, we should just be able to, we should honestly be able to just kind of kill her now. We'll, we'll be fine. All right, pop that again. God, abund abundance is dummy broken. <laughs> abundance is so good, man. It just gives you amazing survivability. Yeah, we got this. We got this. 100% got this. All right, bye-bye. World 6 clear successful. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Hell yeah. No, I can't. Hold on. Do I need any of these? Okay. Oh, that's a really good two piece. No. All right. No, I, I won't. I don't want to waste any Stellar Jades and I don't have a refresh at the moment. That's so unfortunate because I'm about to get some of those purple token things after doing this. <laughs> Hell yeah, though. That was a really, really good run. That came out. Oh, nice. We get the next Herder Jeep as well. That was a really good run. I'm very happy with how that went out. I was honestly kind of not expecting to get that first clear as well, so that's not bad.